For this video, we're going to touch on the changes that can be made to the Expenditures tab. Overall, changes for the Expenditure tab are typically conducted on the left side in the gray shaded area. First and probably most self-explanatory is if you'd like to adjust the timing of an individual expenditure. This is completed in column F. Let's use balcony and railing paint, for example. Currently, the expenditures are in 2026 and 2033. Let's move the project to 2025 by using column F. As you can see, altering the year in column F also adjusts subsequent events. I'll move it back to 2026 again to show the impact. It's important to note to adjust the year in column F as a simple copy and paste won't work based on the timing equation used for expenditures. When adjusting the timing, keep in mind other projects that may be coordinated. For example, here we have the sealants coordinated with masonry events. So if I were to move the sealants up to 2023, all projects are then misaligned. I'll move that back to 2024 to make sure those projects are coordinated. 